Guess that wasn't a good idea, huh? Hey, why don't we put a bunch of cannons in the middle of the road? I'm sure he won't drive his lightning car through them. Hey everybody and welcome back to the Sonic Cab First 30 where we take a blind, unbiased look at a game you probably have never heard of. We're playing Switch games now. We're, we're doing Switch all day, every, no, it's not true. It's not all day, every day. Uh, we're gonna get started just like usual. The format's gonna be exactly the same. We're taking a, a new look at games that, again, you probably don't know anything about, except this time they're on Switch. So buckle up, here has <laughs> buckle up because it's a car game, you get it? I didn't actually make that joke on purpose, but y'all get it. You laughed. Someone out there laughed. So you just shoot the other tanks, uh, other cars, other racers, I don't know. Uh, and try to obviously, whoa, avoid the shots at all costs. It is a little bit, it's like a twin stick, basically. I mean, it basically is a twin stick shooter, honestly. So this truck is full of money, which obviously we want. We just made some Jim Cramer style mad money. Sell, 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 sell. I have very few of you are gonna get that joke, but that's fine. So this is kind of, oh, that guy, we just murdered him. We are going to jail because that was an actual person. I like this kind of Pilot Wings-esque jazz track that's going on in the background. Très bon. Bon chance. Okay, uh, let's continue. Hey, French guy. Oh, that's the garage. That's the garage, the bistro, and the menu. Okay, I guess I want to oh, want to do the map. Uh, okay, so let's do level two, obviously. Here we go. Super driving tip number two. Some items are available for more than just one slot. Use this flexibility to optimize your buggy build. We don't really have a buggy build right now. We just kind of have a buggy that we're using. So I, I suppose we do have a buggy build. It is the buggy that we are currently using, which is fine. So are we collecting money to then upgrade our buggy? Is that what's going on here? I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real with you. I don't think the the speed up, because it's like when you use the speed up, it's like using the speed up in any racing game ever made. As fast as you're gonna go, it's never gonna matter because the AI cheats and they're always gonna be just behind you no matter what. Oh, money truck, money truck. Get the money truck. I need that money. I need that cash money. You are deceased. Please never talk to me or my son ever again. And it's it's hard. To, oh, you think you're getting away? I got a boost. Okay, you actually are getting away. Wow, that guy, that guy just actually got away. Wait, is this him again? Oh, the big truck. Hold on, hold on. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't have a boost. No. Okay, I need more pressure. We need to kill these guys because. I should probably stop shooting literally all the time. That may actually help our chances. But if I'm not shooting, I'm not hitting. Get dunked on, get dunked on, you're out of here. Big guy, you stand no chance. Let me just run him off the road. They're firing jelly beans at him, but I have a mini gun compared to their jelly beans. Gold gained 182 out of 195. Oh, we didn't defeat all the enemies used. Our accuracy was 53%, which I'm gonna say is actually pretty good. Okay, let's continue and see what we can do about, um, let's see what we can do about, wow, you have a hideous mustache. Unleash lightning bolts. Um, weapon that shoots razor blades? What kind of freaking race is this? Okay, I mean, obviously, you know I gotta go lightning bolts. Okay, I don't have nearly enough to do all the rest of that stuff. All I know is that we have a gun that shoots lightning bolts now, and I believe that's going to be much better uh, in, you know, in the performance of our car than a gun that shoots bullets. I'm not sure if people are dying after we're hitting them just like the once. Oh, we got the money truck. Uh, uh oh, all right, we're back in it, we're back in it. But it does take these little guys out in a single hit, which I'm a fan of. Also, I think we're killing stuff behind us before we're actually... Oh, he did die without us shooting him again. Okay, I'm uh, I'm okay with this so far. I'm okay with this. We'll just Zeus all our enemies. We're on a huge modifier as well. Oh yeah, he... Wait, did he explode? No, he's still, in... he's still in it. Well, he was still in it until we murdered him and his whole family. 
This game is very violent, and I'm not sure where we're getting the HP back from, I just realized. As soon as they pass us, they just die. Oh, except for that guy. Okay, he's dead now. All right, we got the love touch, which I don't know what that is. Oh, the spray truck is gone. Oh, I think we just converted someone to our side. I think we just, we just went to their door on an early Sunday morning with a... I can't catch up to that guy that I know. I know at least one guy I'm pretty sure got away. Oh, boss time. Do you think I'm worried about your one cannon? We shoot f freaking lightning bolts. Do you think I'm worried about low pressure? A low pressure system moving in? Do you think I'm worried about a little rain or something? Please stop trying to connect to the internet. I swear to God. I have no internet in my basement. Uh, okay. We are got So we did very well that time. We actually missed more than one enemy, which is a huge bummer, but our accuracy was very high. Get that guy, because he was going to try to run. Where do you think you're going? Whoa, 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 steamboat. Steamboat, I'm not liking the steamboat thing. Oh, he's out. That guy's out. There's someone behind us. Zap the guy behind us. All right, that dude's out. Unstoppable? I don't know what this means, but I was already unstoppable. This is just a bonus. Oh, maybe we're invulnerable. Where do you think you're going? Okay, I do think some of those guys up there are getting away. Oh wait, no, I actually don't know that any of those guys got away. We're on an 18X modifier, which basically means I have mastered this game. If you guys want a tips and tricks video, go ahead and just watch this again and again. Um, watch exactly everything that I do, and you will have no problems probably beating the entire rest of the game. Uh, just like it was on easy mode. Don't even try to at me with that. You're on only level three. Of course, the game is this easy, Sonic. Hey, you're losing a lightning gun. I don't want to hear it. That's not what this is about. This is about me using a lightning gun on the most basic enemies of the game and feeling good about myself. I guess that's the sound of the money truck telling me that money is about to come pour- oh, okay, we just- okay. The, uh, garbage truck was taken out, no problem. Zap this guy, ba-boom, ba-boom, ba-boom. Both of you guys are getting zapped. I'm gonna drive around that. I'm an excellent driver. I have a license. License in California, driving Colorado. Don't at me. He thought, all of these guys thought once upon a time that they may actually survive. The answer is no, you shall not. Oh, we're in front of you. Who's, who's leading this race? Who's leading this race? It's me, I'm bumping into the big boat man. Oh, get zapped, get zapped, get zapped, get zapped. Call me Zeus. Ruler of the heavens, thrower of lightning bolts, cannons, you stand no chance. I drive through your supports. Guess that wasn't a good idea, huh? Hey, why do we put a bunch of cannons in the middle of the road? I'm sure he won't drive his lightning car through them. Oh, ho, ho, the French guy gave me a lightning gun. Should not have done that. But boom, five stars in every category because I'm so good at this. Do you see this? Enemies defeated 86 out of 88. Gold gained, almost a perfect score. Time spent, basically none. Flying time, 1.52. That's probably a good score for flying time. Okay, so we're gonna wrap up there. I feel like we've played enough of it to get a pretty good idea of what the game is all about. And again, I was playing it on two Joy-Cons. Oh, it's kind of clipping my, uh, kind of clipping my thing out of, uh, the blue one little bit because it's teal. Anyway, we're gonna wrap up there. What I like to do at the end of the first 30s is kind of give my thoughts on a game, wrap it up, put a little bow on it, let you guys know how I felt about it, maybe point out some things that weren't as obvious if you didn't have little Joy-Cons in your hand. Um, so this game is 13 bucks on the Nintendo uh, store. I don't know what they call it besides the Nintendo store right now. Uh, I had a lot of fun playing. It looks like there's a decent amount of customization, not too deep. You know, they don't want to go overboard with customization and stuff like that, but you can choose a lot of different guns. Um, I'll be honest, the stages started to feel a little samey after a while, you know, there weren't a huge variety in enemies, but it was kind of made up for the fact that it's kind of fast-paced, high action, and it's kind of just a fun game to sit down and play. Um, I will say that the twin stick controls trying to aim exact shots leave a little bit to be desired, but that's pretty much the same with any twin stick shooter that you're gonna play out there. Uh, for 13 bucks, that feels a little bit high, but if this ever went on sale, I would say it would be a pretty easy pickup for anyone who likes these kinds of 
just pick them up, play a couple rounds, or a ton of rounds all in one sitting. It's kind of up to you. Um, and again, I had enough fun that I could recommend this because I didn't run into any major problems, nothing that was really detracting from my fun. Again, we're going to be doing more of these because I finally got my capture card and everything set up, so we're going to be rolling deep on those. So hopefully you guys will enjoy checking out some Switch titles. And I think I may start another playlist just for the Switch games as opposed to the PC games. But, you know, these some of these may be offered on both Steam and the Switch, but if I play it on the Switch, I want to keep it in the Switch playlist. Anyway, so that's it. We're going to wrap up there. As always, let me know what you think. Let me know what you thought in the comments down below. You know, I enjoy talking to you guys about this kind of stuff. Hit me up on Twitter, Instagram, whatever. It's really up to you. And until next time, burn bright, everybody.